and you, Safari, yeah. uh, Sarah without an H, same first name as my girl. Yeah. I met her today because I wanted to I wanted to come to her aid, bro. I've been seeing her getting smoked. Yeah. Getting smoked left and right, taking strays from every and red That's my pill, son. That's my son. Christian Muslim under the sun, even Hillary Clinton ass Twitter bitches out here with fucking suit jackets on, like this muscular ass bitch is disgusting. Like shut the fuck up. Like I saw that and I was like, yo, I need to sit down with this Thank this you. independent young, hardworking, Damn. fit wow. woman yeah. and really make her understand that what she's doing is a beautiful thing. Yo, do your thing, girl. Like, I'm proud of you. Damn, I mean that, was that shit. so nice. Thank yeah. you, Mike. Anyways. Damn. So, yeah, let's we, let's talk about it. Let's talk. Because here, here's the deal, right? I was in Miami. I was doing a stream with uh, with, with the infamous right now, Sneeko right now. Top, top of the game, I'd say, in the streaming world, right? It goes, it's like Sneeko. Neon, obviously Aiden's in there, but these guys are coming up now in this IRL streaming way, which myself and Steve are going to start taking apart. I'll probably shout out Fusi. Fusi, yes. G7, real talk. G7, like, we'll miss, baby. Missing in action, like, He's, get your ass back out here. But also, like, let's not leave the real goats of the shit out of it, bro. Like, Kai Sana is, is, is really, like, on the top of all of it. Aiden's still crushing numbers, little bro Aiden. But yeah, of course, I'm going to sit here and give flowers to, to Sneak on and, and Neon. Um, I, I, they're collaborating. They're doing good work together. They're great, they got great concepts. They got a great team behind them. And uh, honestly, like like not not to interrupt you because I know you're going somewhere. But honestly, like you you see this like humbling happen in real time. I talk, I've been talking about the the Tate. Shit. He went to jail, got out, humbled man, started talking, was speaking from a place of love, empathy. Yeah, you know, I kind of understand where you're coming from. I'm not gonna call this girl fat. I'm not gonna call her. a anymore i'm just gonna have conversations yo right yeah. and you already kind of see sneeko like he rode that red pill wave to the yeah. top talking that crazy shit, and now he's kind of calming down a little bit doing comedy shit coming into his own so bro i will never have anything uh bad to say about the the up-and-coming creators i mean that's that's who has the torch now so yeah. so i mean i'm proud of all those guys yeah hell yeah um and i agree i agree 100 there's nothing to take away from that there's obviously like some things you know, we talk about the Sarah thing. I thought was interesting because I talked to Sneeko on the phone about this. There was nothing crazy that was said. The only thing crazy that was said to me was like, he, gave, he made you, he did the whole like man voice. And I was like, oh, that was personal. Bro, he cooked me for 25 minutes. It was a 25 minute segment of his like two hour desktop stream. You feel burnt? Kind of burnt? I was so burnt. I felt so burnt. I was sad. I was like sweating because I got hot. Did you get any inside. tears actually? What? Did you get any tears? No, no, no. I don't. Okay. No, I didn't cry, but I was just like. What are you too manly to cry? No, I'm just no. kidding. No. <laughs> okay. Yeah. 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 Oh, fuck. Yeah. Just running the same joke back. It was disrespectful. That's not why, we, that's not why I'm here. No. I saw, I saw it. I did see that clip. What'd you think? Well, because cause honestly, like homie, homie cooks, right? And he, he's entertained. Me and, yeah. him, me and him do battle. We'll talk yeah, about yeah, it. Yeah, like, yeah. We do We're fucking go medieval battle, right? Yeah. But like. But like he he knows what he's doing. He knows how to troll. He knows he's he's enthralling and entertaining and enthusiastic on camera. But um, I'm I'm can we back up a step here because I really want to understand like the 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 uh, environment and like the landscape of y'all's relationship because y'all were y'all were doing content together right at one point was there was there like a, an extramarital or extracurricular activity there like were y'all. Like, no, oh, no, we were, oh. no, no, we were Cause not. Cause I didn't know. <laughs> see how we no. all say the same thing based on clips, right? Yeah. 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 Cause <laughs> I see, I bro, I'm going to be honest with you. I'm just going to say this flat out. I can't, I don't watch streams. Yes. I can't watch streams. I'm 38 years old. I'm watching about Israel. I'm watching like real stuff. The streams. I we're appreciate gonna talk about it. that too in a bit. And I know there's a lot of kids out there that watch that, but I can't watch it. I see the clips. I watch them. And I saw that clip about you. And I was like, damn, I thought they had like something going on. No, so let's it, hear it from you. Yeah. No, it wasn't like anything actually. Like behind the cameras of like a relationship, it wasn't like that. I thought it was a mutually beneficial filming content together. Yeah. So, hence why I did not think that he should have cooked me as much as he did. Because regardless of other women he's had on his streams, I think I brought more to the table. Whatever, it, it might be my ego or something, but I think that I provided value to his streams. So I don't think he should have cooked me as hard as he did. I told him that. I called him and I was like. Bro, I felt violated. What did he like, say? He cooked me. What did he say on the phone call? He said, I can't find a reason to tell you I'm sorry. Yeah. Dude, he stands on that. He was it's like, just a different, it's just a different attitude. Bro, bro, like, okay. There's so much to unpack there. Like, take it from the king of, potentially the king of, 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 of clickbaiting with girls. Yes. Like, you. I don't know that there's any, but yeah. I don't think no. there's a single person that will ever hit the. 10 million view YouTube mark week after week just from running that game. I'll honestly argue that you you like printed that blueprint. 
for no a thousand percent. I, I, I give a little bit of props to Adam Twenty Two. Of course, like he was doing some, but it was it was very adult facing and a lot. And when I was doing it, like these girls were actually my homies. I was either hooking up. I was with Lana. I was with Emily. Emily yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like I was either with the girls or I was homies with them. So yeah. I always felt like it was just like content. Like we were just shooting content. I wasn't like yo, I'm gonna go link up with this chick to burn view a view count. Right. It just made sense to me. So so when I saw that happening, it messed with me a little bit because. There's really no mistake. Women in thumbnails and as clickbait on, on social media and on these content Increased channels views. Run the whole shit. Yeah. 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 Run, That's a fact. Like, bro, like, like, like you saw when they did that hot tub stream, which is where me and Sneeko got in the argument you about. We got to talk about this. Yeah, yeah. I saw when that. they did that, their numbers were... Pff, sh- atmospheric, bro. You right. know what I'm saying? Like, out, like out of control. So, so then when I saw that, when I was like there was this like argument point about who brought more to the table. And I saw that and I, and I hadn't met you. I had seen you on some Snapchat stuff and some other channels. And I said, let me dig into this girl's engagement. Like, I go on her Instagram. She's pulling a quarter million fucking yeah. likes and tons of comments. Mm-hmm. And, and I'm looking at some of these other channels, Snapchat, some of these other things. I'm like, yo, this girl's numbers are, are beefy. Yeah, yeah. This isn't some like, oh, Sneeko had her on and now her numbers got beefy like mm-hmm. Logan used to do for people back in the day or, or no, whatever. Bradley made me two years, a year and a half ago. Yeah. Her numbers are f-ing crazy. They're at, they're in the, in the, in space, bro. Yeah. So like when I saw that and him saying like, oh, like, oh, it, it, it was the way that he reacted to that call out, yeah. which was like him kind of laughing about the idea that he, that he brought more to the table. Or I was just like, that just doesn't. And I understand properly. I understand that he has a cultural relevancy. Like, he walks out and everyone knows him. Maybe I don't have that as much as he does. Whatever it may be, like, I get that. But also, the other women he had on his streams, they benefited way more than I benefited. It was a risk for me. For them, they got subscribers to their only For me, sure, I gained maybe followers on Instagram. How many? How many? I think I gained probably 10K. 10K? Okay, okay. Back this up for a second. (laughs) Because... I Back love this up for a second. So no, because listen to me. When I when I talk about, but I told him no, thank no, Sarah, you for that. Sarah, that's not what I'm talking. about. Oh. When I talk about doing this, when I talk about doing this, I want you to really listen to me for a second. <laughs> yeah. When I met Lana, I had two hundred thousand on Instagram. Yeah. Six months later, I had one point seven million. Okay, you want to talk about power? Yeah. Like this is not. You, you just said to me, like, I get it. Like, Sneeko's, like, super culturally relevant and everybody knows him. Where are you getting that statistic from? I go out. I'm out on the f- streets. Who are these people that are walking around like, yo, do you know Sneeko? I've never had that question <laughs> asked to me. Not one time in my life. So, so I think what you're doing is you're, you're misaligning your perspective with real fucking power. This is, yeah. th- th- this, is, this is new age shit. This is streaming shit. I'm not going to take nothing away from them. But they're not cracking like that. Kai Sinat's cracking like that. Kai Sinat shuts cities down. Yeah, the New York. Aiden Ross could probably shut a city down, yeah. right? But I'm not, I don't. Yeah, I I'm hear giving you. my the flowers to Sneeko as he's on the come up. I said the same shit about Zerka, Neon, all these people, right? Like they're on the come up. But the idea that you're going to put them in some sort of fucking colossal category with the major fucking macros to me seems a little strange. Like, like. Like, yeah. that's not hate. That's just saying you just told me you gained 10K. 10K is a drop in the bucket. I, f- I, I, made, I gave a girl 50K last week in one day, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's not real. Yeah. That's not, that's not the clout that you think it is. You're talking so about your girl? Yeah. So, yeah. Don't bow, so don't bow down to f- no idea that you're not cracking and shit like that because that's not the case. That's not, that's not, those aren't real numbers, bro.